Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are cooking fresh Atlantic salmon filet on the grill in tin foil. So we're going to start with almost a two pound salmon filet. I'm going to get this on the foil. Get the now that we have it on the foil, we're going to go ahead and make just a little tray for it to cook in. So we're kind of going to fold up the edges here. And like I said, we're just kind of making a tray for it to cook in so that the juices don't run all over the grill. And we just do this by folding up the foil. Okay, now that we got it in the foil, we're going to use just a little bit of garlic salt, just a thin coat of garlic salt, because we're going to put some minced garlic on here. So, Lowry's garlic, garlic salt, or your favorite brand. And we're going to put some minced garlic on here. And this is, this is to taste. So I like, I like a lot of garlic on here, so we're just going to spread this around real nice. And we're going to use butter. So just take your normal stick of butter. I just cut a bunch of chunks of butter right here. And put on, you know, just kind of spread it around. This is going to basically, once it starts melting on the grill, it's going to run down into your foil pan and basically then your salmon is going to cook in the butter. So I like to go generous on the butter. That's good. And then what I do is take a fresh lemon, slice this up and uh, just take lemon slices, put on top of this. And I take the end of the lemon here and kind of just squeeze it out, get a little of that extra lemon juice. So that's how simple that is. And we're going to get it on the grill in just a minute as soon as that warms up. But as I said, we're ready to grill. I'm also drinking a uh, blue cheese stuffed olive martini today with dinner. If you want to know how to make these tasty treats, I do have a video on how to do that, so uh, I'll post a link to that down in the description. Okay, since this is ready for the grill, and the grill's now heated up, we're going to go ahead and get this guy on the grill. Uh, it's going to cook for about 15 minutes or till done. So, show you how to tell when it's done, but right now, we're going to get it on the grill. Okay, so we're about to get this on the grill. Um, I recommend putting this on a cookie sheet, at least taking it off the grill because uh, all that butter is going to be melted and it's going to be hard to hold that underneath. So uh, you see we got our foil pan set up, kind of made up real nice. And the grill is at uh, about 300, between 3 and 350 right now, somewhere maybe 325 range. So again, 15 minutes or until done and I'll show you how to tell that. but. Uh, we're gonna close this grill up and get this stuff cooking, so we'll be back. Okay, so it's been about 15 minutes here, actually just a little bit more than 15 minutes. And what you wanna check for is you see the layers right here, you can see the layers of the meat. You wanna to go to the thickest part. Oh yeah, that's done, look at that. You see how that just peels right apart like that? So as soon as you can peel it apart like that, this salmon's done, you just don't want it you don't want it raw and if it's translucent in the middle and it peels hard then it's definitely not done so we're going to pull this right off the grill here like i said this is why we're going to use a a cookie sheet because it's easy to slide right onto the cookie sheet and much easier to carry in the house okay so we got this inside on the hot pads and uh look at this like i said when that skin peels or when those 
layers peel like that, you know that's nice and done. And uh, let's taste this here. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That is amazing. Now, some people say the uh, the best stuff for you is in the skin. It's nice and crispy. You can eat that. A lot of people don't, but you can. That's crispy. So basically, you can see where this is falling apart here. This is almost coming apart. So I'm gonna cut this up. You know, you can basically I just discard the lemons and then we just divide this up and eat it like this usually but yeah look how easy that falls apart that's just oh look how tender that is and juicy look at look at the, look at how moist that is this is about to be amazing right here mm. that's good stuff so Hope yours turns out as good as mine does. Leave me a comment. Let me know how it turns out. Please uh, remember to like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already. Click that little bell. You'll get notifications when I post new videos. And uh, see you next time. Thanks for tuning in.